Hey guys, Katie Day with Coldwell Banker here with Ryan Rossbluff with Guaranteed Rate Affinity. Um, today we're gonna kind of talk about the uh, mortgage process and kind of, I guess, a quick overview of how to buy a house. A, um, once a client is under contract, what would you say are things that they should avoid doing or, or situations you've had in the past that may, you know, kind of mess things up or like kind of the do's and don'ts of once you're under contract? Sure, should be sure. Some of the critical things that, that buyers should not do, which I've seen as well. Okay, so what a, what a, what a buyer would not want to do is go out and start shopping for furniture, mm -hmm. appliances, because that will have additional credit checks. Obviously, if they incur more liabilities, that's additional debt, which could cause an issue for them to get approved. Okay. Uh, really, what a customer or a buyer does not want to do is anything different financially. They don't want to move money between bank accounts mm -hmm. because the lender's going to have to document that movement. And it may or may not be an issue, but it will definitely cause more people. Okay. Um, they definitely want to keep their job. Uh, <laughs> don't <you> know, we all? <laughs> don't don't quit your job or get fired. Okay. That would be a problem. Uh, but the main thing is just maintain your credit as it is. Okay. Try not to inquire for anything new. And if you have any questions about what you should or shouldn't do, talk to your lender first. Yeah. Okay. That makes sense. Um, if you guys have any mortgage-related questions, please contact Ryan Rossloff with Guaranteed Rate Affinity, and uh, we'll talk to you soon. Thank you. Thank you.